after the success of the Totally Locally market launch in West Bridgeford last month. The local businesses teamed up again on Saturday the 5th of November to show the whole community the benefits of shopping locally. Richard from the Tall Frog made fresh local soups to warm up shoppers. Today we've got a couple of uh, fresh soups on today. Um, we've got a fish soup which all the produce have been bought from uh, the vegetable shop down there and the fish has been bought from Paolo's Fish store to make the make this one and then I've got a tomato soup that's all locally made and um, I've got another one spinach and lentil soup very nice and all bought locally well one thing it supports the local community and everything like that um, it helps those those guys up plus it's just two shops down as well which is even better you know it's all really really close you know so we can't really ask for more really There were lots of stalls at the market, including Harrington's Fudge, a new business to recently join Totally Locally West Bridgeford. The fudge is made with local ingredients bought from West Bridgeford and can now be bought inside the Tall Frog, perfect as a Christmas present. It's been really good, yeah, it's been really busy. We've sold 44, and I was, it's blown me away really. We're going to have to go running forth and back to get some more. It's been great. We have mango and pineapple and banana and strawberry. It's all locally sourced fruit and veg, so it's just great that we're here doing this today. But shopping, of course, is not everyone's cup of tea. Therefore, to make the whole event go with a swing, musicians Dapper Dan and the Chili Dogs were playing outside Taste Cafe throughout the day to entertain the shoppers. Totally Locally West Bridgeford has now taken on board local photographer Paul Carroll. He explains the importance of investing into the community through local businesses. I think it's really important, you know, if we can all uh, trade within each other, you know, it can uh, reduce our own overheads and sort of share the wealth locally rather than importing things, uh, you know, internationally or even from other regions. It creates a bit of community as well, doesn't it? You know, um, where you know your local butcher, you know your local delicatessen, your local photographer, um, and the, there is a bit more of a sort, sort of sense of community and helping each other out. As winter is approaching, we all need to wrap up warm. Luckily, Karina is now a totally locally business, selling her hand-knitted scarves. Many people were interested in them. I gave them my details. That they would like to order some different, uh, different colors. So, so far, so good.